Praise the Lord, my beloved ones. Today we shall pray the prophetic prayers for your marriage, for your marriage to be fulfilled, for your prayers to be answered. So I am praying and we are praying together so that your prayers for your marriage shall be answered. Hallelujah, glory be to God alone. Praise the Lord, praise the Lord. Thank you, O Lord, thank you, Father. Thank you, Lord Jesus Christ, for you have already answered them. They have believed and you have answered them. According to their faith, it will manifest. They have already received the prophetic word. Let them receive it more and more deeper in the spirit womb. You said they will call upon me and I will answer them. They have called upon your name lord jesus christ and you will answer them for their marriage the marriage prayer shall be answered bless them with the faith yes lord you are working upon their faith so that according to your will it shall happen it shall work it shall be done it shall be settled yes lord you are the one and only one living god who answers their prayers there are people all over the world, your children, your precious ones, your chosen ones. They have prayed for a life partner. They have prayed for the spouse, their own husband or their own wife. You have blessed them prophetically. You have blessed them under the apostolic anointing so that they will bear fruit for the kingdom of God. They will have marriage. They will be blessed with children. They will be blessed even with children's children. We pray this prayer in faith of God so that they will receive from you the right spouse. Not chosen from the world, not coming from anywhere else, but coming from heaven above. And they have asked you for a godly husband or godly spouse. The godly husband is coming, the godly wife is coming, and you shall dwell happily. In the house of the Lord, there shall be blessings. You will not lack anything and you will be blessed. Tonight, O oh Lord Jesus Christ, they are blessed. Their marriage is blessed. The ceremony is blessed. The wedding amount shall be provided. The wedding gown and the dressing style will be chosen by the Lord. The groom shall look more brighter and more handsome because this is also the day the chosen one of the lord for salvation you are going to invite many people to their marriage and they shall be blessed prophetically there shall be salvation there shall be soul winning even when they are getting married and getting together prophetically as you are revealing to them this prayers they have asked for shall be answered so Lord, you have already planned for them their marriage. Their wedding is already planned. Their godly ordained spouse is already ordained. Everything is already planned. According to your date, according to your time, according to your purpose. Because it's not the purpose of the world. It's not even because they are getting older. It's not because they are in age. It is because you love them. It is your grace, it is your will, and there is purpose behind this marriage. There's the purpose, there shall be the soul winning. Lord, you have blessed them and you have given them commandment to do whatever they can do for soul winning. So they have prayed a marriage for soul winning. There shall be many people saved with this marriage. Their family members will be saved. Their friends will be saved. Their relatives will be saved. The household will come together under the same anointing. It's their calling. Not only this, after this marriage, they will pray for many people and they will participate in marriages of many people so that through them, prophets will be born. Their marriage is prophetic and it's for prophetic anointing. They are praying for this, that their marriage should happen not for their selfish desires, not because they need a support, 
they want to get married because they are called and their spouse is the destiny helper they have received this prophetic word their destiny helper is in their spouse the destiny helper is the one who will help them and they will help one another you have already taught them lord the kingdom financiers they will bless the lord with their wealth they will honor the lord made for one another for a calling to give that support to be made perfect for one another for righteousness sake for they are righteous people chosen ones from heaven and not picked up from the worldly desires it is your will that you have created them as a new creation they are the born again people of god and this marriage is holy the child born is holy they are the inheritance of the sin free generation i pray and i bless them so that their upright marriage will manifest they have prayed for it bless them with your word bless them with your faith bless them with the revelation bless them with the manifestation let your glory for their marriage come upon them right now you have answered them all glory be to god alone thank you lord jesus christ thank you father my beloved ones this is the answer for the prayers for your marriage that you have been praying since years and years and the lord god will bless you for a purpose do not ask or miss the word of god says don't ask anything which is ungodly don't ask or miss as being led by the holy spirit and only those prayers are answered if you like him you like her it's not about your liking it's the will of the lord it's the ministry is the purpose it's the grace for purpose and your prayer shall be answered the lord knows you have been praying the lord is waiting only for the right purpose so your prayers must be aligned to the will of the lord which we have done now these prayers they align to the will of the lord so receive this video as much as you can and bless others as well with this prophetic prayers like the video share it be an evangelist share this video and do subscribe to this channel if you're led by the holy spirit to this channel for the first time you have plenty and many more blessings to receive and do comment with an agreement that yes you do believe in the prayers you believe in the alignment with god you believe in an agreement you have the covenant marriage in your heart so you're not asking for a miss you're asking for a covenant marriage glory be to god alone hallelujah god is my shepherd i shall not be in want we thank all those who are honoring the lord with their wealth and for all the offerings we bless you with a hundredfold of return my beloved ones if you have not yet received our lord god jesus christ if you have not yet received the holy spirit we shall pray a small prayer because this repentance is at hand our father in heaven we come into your presence to our lord jesus christ and today we receive salvation we receive holy spirit into our heart oh lord forgive us our sins and help us to be born again we shall seek you oh lord jesus christ unto zion in jesus mighty name amen my beloved ones with the small prayer of repentance your sins are forgiven and you have received holy spirit within you you shall walk the walk of righteousness